myself again. I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Let me live with that for a moment. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of God of War. I'm just going to jump right into it. And thanks for checking it out. We can take this way back to the camp. Oh, so now can you can burn those. Uh, now embed your blades into the glowing vines and light it. Ah. Your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to go back to how it was. Leaving the responsibilities of leadership to me. I mean, do you blame him, though? Sigil arrow spread. Shoot sigil arrows at burning or frosted enemies. It's not as though I want to be angry with Freyr. He's my brother. He was the most important person in the world to me for half my life. Imagine like plot twist, her brother's the one that sold her. <laughs> That'd be wild. These plants are the same as those we saw earlier. Frost should make quick work of their poison. Mm, yep. We'll need to adjust our strategy since there's more than one. Let's try using a sigil. Oh. 
Well done. Oh, so her sigil stay there? It's cool. Thought I ran past something. Never mind. Watch out, those are wisps. Powerful manifestations of runic magic. <laughs> My arrows can disrupt their protection spell. Could I ever think this place is home again? After all that's happened. I can't get up there. Either that or I just don't know how, but it's okay. Wait. Skull and Hardy are in Vanaheim? We learned the giants rescued them from Odin and brought them here. And look. The sunlight wakes the sleeping roots. See how they stretch to welcome the sun? Beautiful, no? A far cry from the sheets of Midgard snow I've grown accustomed to. The Eastern Migration. It's just as I remember it. At least the whole realm hasn't fallen to predators and occupiers. I guess there's still something to be fought for. Something to defend even after so much damage has been done. Maybe that goes for Freyr, too. Come on, baby. We need some dinner. Nope. <clears throat> too far. These rooms. able to damage it without destroying the mother. It's a large bulbous thing. You can't miss it. Hmm? Nope, I'm bad. I think you'd have better luck burning it. Giants definitely crafted it. There's two wolves represented here. Perhaps a connection to our friends in the sky. Yeah. A mystery for another time. <clears throat> hmm. 
My sigils can break through their shields. They're defenseless now. I forgot I could do that, I'm honest. What the hell was poisoning me? This? Yep. Uh. Oh, there she is. So much has happened since I last saw Freya. I'm not even sure where to begin. What do you want from him? An apology would be a start. I want to forgive him. I'd like to think he's changed. He's all I have left now. Did you ever apologize to Demos? It is difficult to seek forgiveness when you feel unworthy. He killed his brother, didn't he? Now, how to get across? My sigil arrow should be able to carry the fire across the river to reach the bramble. Oh, I got a daisy chain. Okay. One there. One there. One there. Forgiveness can be powerful, even for the unworthy. My wife, Faye, taught me that. Hmm. Well, be glad you have a spouse to remember from me. <laughs> Oh, I thought she broke it. Shield strike. The whip replicate. 
These two work good together, just saying. All my former spouse taught me was that there's no limit to the depths to which a soul can sink into darkness. Tricked me into marriage to spare my home and took my home just the same. Scattered my people to the wind. Maybe it's time somebody drew the line. Maybe it's time someone makes Groa's prophecy come true. I will not wish for war, Freya. War is a terrible thing, Kratos. But some things are even worse. You know, if Atreus rushes to Ragnarok, you may not be able to stop him. I will. And if you fail? I have prepared him to survive without me, if he must. Watch for the plants. They like me, but strangers, not so much. Yeah, yeah, it's I fine. That. She went that way, so I'm going this way. Obviously. Right. There we go. So what's next for you? If not preparing for war, I do not know. But I will. A quiet life. With Atreus. Well, you may want to think fast unless you want someone to make that choice for you. Ready? As I ever will be. At last. Yes. Uh, let's celebrate. You reclaim the throne. We'll rebuild. Me and you against the world. Huh? Just like the old days. I'm not staying. I don't understand. You're here. Maybe together we can take back what's ours. I only just got back what's mine. I still have work to do. You've seen what's left of the realm, right? Do we really mean that little to you? You question my loyalty? Vanaheim turned its back on me. Oh, you still can't let go of that old fight. It was my duty to save as many of our people as possible. My responsibility, one you didn't take seriously then, and from the looks of it, one you don't now. You think this is a game to me? Yeah. <sighs> we lost everything to that maniac you called husband. The man's family set me on fire. How did you expect me to react? Like my brother. 
Like the boy that used to have my back no matter what. And who I always supported no matter how selfish his choices. I expected you to come and find me. That no matter how hurt or angry, you wouldn't abandon me. Freya, please. I thought you were dead. No. I've had to live lifetimes with those last awful words I said to you. Have any idea what that's like? Knowing that your own selfishness hurt the person that you cared about the most. Abandon you. Oh, Freya. I mourned you. Oh, I missed you so much. But I won't bind myself to another realm when I finally have my freedom. I'll send help, though. And I will come back. I promise. This hasn't been your home for a long time, has it? Do what you gotta do. All right, all right, that's enough. Ain't y'all got nothing better to do than gawking at family sorting squabbles? Come on, you two. God, I love him. Not you. <laughs> You stay ass. Got a few things to square with y'all. First is you collecting your spare head. Second is that sigil magic I smell on your bow. Wait a Reckon minute. That's an idea I'll steal. No. Nope. How's about I Damn set it. you up with some <clears throat> sonic mojo? Call it a trade. Very well. Third of all, if and you ain't staying here. Bears mentioning that Sindri and I find ourselves running a flop house for unemployed gods. If you're done freezing your backside off in Midgard, maybe come back with Beardo there. Check up on your old pal Tyr. That's kind of you, bro. I may do just that. Well, all right then. I'll meet y'all back at the house. Lesson you want me to fix anything up first. Well, oh. Care to meet our new allies? Or hey. shall we depart? Shut up. So is that big fella we're traveling with might want to help me with a thing? Mayhaps. Now nope. and again, he's in the mood to make you full. Nice. May I ask? Um, yes, blades. Upgrade. Shield. Lord Freyr, who was left in me back together. He saved me. Gave me a family. A purpose. And I will gladly die for both. Thank you. He's lucky to have you. Probably escaped the blows whom they're breathing far north of here. Mm. She was beyond saving, but he never gave up. She healed and hasn't left us since. 
All right, that's it. She's pure of heart. Believes in your uh, even if you don't. I remember where to look for a gateway. Follow me. Well, you two seem to be getting on since completing your mission. Dare I hope this alliance has some staying power after all? It seems to me we share a common enemy. Kratos, you may not accept that Ragnarok is inevitable, but you're smart enough to know Odin is a threat. Whatever comes next, our best chance of surviving it is to work together. Do you agree? I do. <laughs> then as to Brock's offer, you can imagine staying under the same roof as a couple former enemies? No further mutations towards terrible vengeance? Not against you. Either of you. You have my word. Nice. Good idea. I haven't looked at my skills in so long. Uh, frail armor. Accessory. Sure. I don't know what I just put on there, but it's fine. Leviathanax. That's gold. about this one? That wouldn't be bad. Like that one. That was not bad. Do that one. And let's just do both of these. is different from others you might know. You'll need an enchantment on your chisel to use it. Oh, 
Runa. Go ahead, carve the letter. Suna. It's an incantate. Suna. The elves in Freyr's camp mentioned a gate like this in Alfheim. Kept on about some sacred light elf sanctum out past the barrens. A trip to Alfheim? Well, we can decide at the gateway. This boat should get us there if we can clear those vines. Remember what to do? Uh... There's a fallen log in the river. It has something on it I don't recognize. Ah. We're clear. So it's true. Tears really alive? Aye. Not exactly ship shape. He sleeps in a broom closet now, but he's adjusting. How did you find him? Largely, that's down to Atreus having figured out how to access the prophecies giants reserved for their own kind. We only learned of it ourselves after Thor and Odin came calling. To your home? Is it still standing? Barely. But all the violence was seemingly just a distraction to let Odin have a private word with Atreus. Odin was alone with your son? Did he tell you what they spoke of? Yes. He said that Odin invited him to Asgard to help him find his answers. The answers he's rushing into fate in search of. That's troubling. Well, if you're ready to talk to him, the Mystic Gateway is ahead. If not, I have some unfinished business up this river I could use your help with. Or we can follow up on that elven sanctum out in Alfheim's desert. Hmm. Uh, if you want to continue have. exploring, we'll need to remove that log in the river. Trying to keep on with the story. What is this? The crest of Skirnir. Never quite as smart as he thought. Uh, sit yourselves. Well, brother, before you see the lad again, might we discuss you an approach? You tell me where he has been. That is my approach. Ah, classic Spartan diplomacy. Wait. Did you say Odin invited him to Asgard, and then he disappeared for two days? Aye. But surely the lad's got more sense than Don't to... Don't underestimate Odin's powers of persuasion. He filled my son's head with lies. Why wouldn't he do the same with yours? Hmm. And you're not wrong. And you tell that one-eyed nutsucker he owes me one. Fight me now and eternally. Well, look <laughs> there. Glad you could make the trip, your goddessness. I put your sigil magic on the young turd's bow, but then he and Sindri got into it over something. Mm, I don't rightly know who's yelling at who in there, but I figure they both got it coming. Well, come on then. Hey, Tyr, wake up, you got company. Now, why don't you just make yourself at home in Sindri's so-called study over yonder? You're sure he won't mind? Mind? You better screw his head back on. And I mean tightly. So, you're back. Are you ready to answer me? About what? Where did you go? Who did you see? Was it Odin? What? Is that what you think? Do you deny it? <laughs> Answer me! 
Did you go to Asgard? No. Of course not. But so what if I did? It's my future, it's my life. You are my son. Then why don't you trust me? If you want me to trust you, then tell me the truth. The truth is you're being a complete asshole. Laddie, you know that's oh, no way to change a man's no. mind. He doesn't have any faith in me. It's fine if he keeps secrets. It's fine if mom did. That is not fine. Her secrets haunt every step of this path. Oh, okay. So you don't believe in her anymore either? This is not about your mother. What you have done is lie. Wonder where I learned that. That's quite enough. Since when do you always take his side? Since he became the one making sense. Look, I was only thinking about going to Odin. But I swear it's for a good reason. There is no good reason to go to Odin. He'll only cloud your mind. But I'd be going for us. I, I gotta stop something bad from happening. Something bad did happen. Look at me, at Freya, at Tia. Odin did this to us. What's well, got everyone caterwauling all of a sudden? Atreus wants to go to Asgard. Asgard? Get kicked in the head or something? Great. I guess everybody's against me now. Yep. You must choose who you're going to be. Are you going to continue to lie and keep things from me? Or are you my son? Choose? I never get to choose. Just leave me alone. Listen. Let go of me. Listen. Jack, let go. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh it. shit. It's Sindri. Just, just try to keep control. Oh, great. Freezing <laughs> cold, lots of hell walkers, definitely in Midgard. Keep it coming. You're just helping me stay warm. These things? When did it get so bad out here? Yep. Home sweet home. Do her up, bro. Gotta find some shelter. At least something out here doesn't want to kill me. <laughs> Just need someplace warm. Ah! Then I can figure out where to go next. Uh, that doesn't look good. <laughs> what is Ouch. this thing? Some kind of white? What is it you want? Oh, 
Ouch. More ravens. You trying to tell me something? First, he thinks I've been to Asgard. Then, blind. Ah! I'm trying to save your life, you big jerk! <laughs> Trying to save your life, you big jerk. Big ass. and then what? Where could I go? If I go to Asgard, following the prophecy where father ends up dead, if I stay locked up at home, there's nothing I can do to stop it. I guess in Asgard, I could at least keep an eye on Odin. Be a spy. Find out his plan. Get control of this. I don't think that's a good idea, little oh, one. Who am I kidding? I can't go to Asgard. Wait, are those red leaves? Freya's house. Oh no. Charlie. Oh, no. Charlie. Please. Please. Charlie. Hey, 
big guy? I'm here now. Don't you worry. I need to get you warm. You're gonna have to stand to let me into that house. Think you can do that? Come on, Charlie. You have to do this. I... I can't help if you don't... Emily! Emily! Close that window before snooping around. Freya hasn't been checking on you? Right. Too busy hunting us down. Come on. Let's get you warmed up. Uh, Should be able to make a fire from all this mess. Wow. It's beautiful. Never seen anything like this around here before. From her home in Vanaheim? She must have really missed it. Is this... Baldur's? Wonder how Father was able to earn her forgiveness. Valkyrie armor? Does this go with the wings on the wall? From her friend? Wonder what happened to her. I can't believe she never came back to check on her house. To check on you. That's not an excuse. You gonna have wood in there or just paper? One thing of paper. You're welcome. Where do I go now? I can't stay. I just can't let my dad die too. There's gotta be something I can do. here for me I'll be okay don't do it I think okay I'm ready take me to him Ah! 
Should have learned to swim before Midgard froze over. Yeah. Hello? I'm here. Odin? Wait, that's all that was? Bird. Oh, yeah, okay. Is this Asgard? Hey, wait up! The wall! This is Asgard! Hold on! I'm coming! Oh! You don't seem friendly. Die. Oh, there's more. Ow. You're the one that spit at me. Bitch. This Where the hell is the last one? This way. Where? Ah, there you are. Sign of Fimble Winter. I better keep heading towards the wall. You could have led me around those. <laughs> or just don't give a shit, bro. Yeah, danger. I know. Got it. I see him. I came to be your apprentice, I guess. But it doesn't mean I like serve you now. Uh -uh. Foretold by prophecy kind of thing. Ouch. Ah! 
<sighs> but it's safe from the other side of that wall. Wait, how do I get past the wall? I never came up with a mere story about Hunter. The stonemason's son built a flaw into it. He only told Frey about it. And I didn't think to ask. Hold on. I was Frey at the house. Did she move in with us? <laughs> you know what? Focus, Loki. Father would just burn this away with his blades. But what can I do? Um. Huh. Maybe that sigil magic on my bow can help. What did Brock say? If I could just get that fire to spread to the bramble. What fire? Am I crazy? No way up from here. I'd better figure a way through that bramble. Oh. Alka. Go. Go. Just say the same thing I say. One, two, three. Better angle on that fire. Uh, what? Okay. One. Alka. Those aren't touching. Okay. Let's do one. Two. Three. There we go. Sounds like people. <laughs> yep. 
You need help? You, uh, you look a little lost. Oh, uh, I'm just getting my bangs. Well, there's nothing to see this way except the big wall. Is there a gate to go through? <sighs> nope. Not unless you're an ace your god, but I guess you'd know that if you were an ace your god. Me? No. I'm from Midgard. What? No shit. Me too. I'm skilled here. Lucky. Hang on. Are you all from Midgard? <laughs> yep. The, uh, All Father saved us from the desolation, gave us a safe place to settle, but we don't go in there. Can't get into the city unless you know magic. Do you. You don't know magic, do you? A little bit, yeah. What? No shit. You, can you walk through walls? Not yet. Huh. Couldn't I just climb over it? <laughs> that? Without any gear? Uh, no. Aren't you afraid of dying? Well, yeah. I mean, look at that. But... Odin awaits. Uh -uh. Wait, you know the Allfather? I'm sort of his apprentice. No shit! What is he teaching you? I'm not sure. Well, how many other students? I don't know. How long are you staying? You don't know. Okay. I'm gonna go climb that wall now. Well. This I gotta see. You need help? I appreciate it, but I gotta go alone. Oh, I wasn't gonna climb with you. I may owe Odin my life, but I don't owe him my death. Not that I think you're gonna fall. Forget I said anything. Huh. Is that Hugin? Is Hugin your guide? Who? You seem like a good guy. I really hope I am not about to watch you die. Thanks. Me too. Uh, you, you know not to look down, right? I like looking down. Shows me how much progress I've made. Wow. Yeah, that's great. Can I use that? I mean, a little ironic last words, but... What was that? <laughs> Nothing. Hey, you're doing great. <sighs> oh, this way. Wouldn't catch me doing this shit. Absolutely not. You can do it, Loki. Thanks, Gilder. Hope you're right. Okay, I can do this. This is fine. Just keep climbing. And now where? Over there. Uh, this way. Hey, Hoogan. Don't suppose you'd like to pass the time by telling a story, would ya? There ain't no way he can still yeah. hear us. That's what I thought you'd say. A white? Up here? Yeah, I'm coming. Let's get that chain down. Um, what now? Oh, my bad. <laughs> Jump up. Uh, 
jump. All right. Can I climb up it or? There we go. I'm told. I wonder why I can't hear your thoughts. Sure seemed like Odin could. That was you in our cabin, right? You and your brother, I guess. Taking that for a yes. Breathe and jump. Ah! Yes. I bet I'm past the worst of it now. Or not. Wanna just let me pass through? No? Have it your way. Help up! are connected. Yeah, that makes sense. I think. Gotta do both sides, though. Mm. Thank you. Stop. Hi. This might work. Ooh. Go. Oh shit. Made it. Ah! Book of War with. Yep. Ah. to fly. I'm doing what I can. Huh. I don't see any more shortcuts. Just gotta climb a little further. 
Maybe a lot further. But I've come this far. Hey, Hugin. How about I tell you a story? Once there was a giant named Loki, who thought it'd be a good idea to accept Odin's invitation to Asgard. So, Odin tested Loki, expecting him to climb by himself all the way up Reimther's wall. So, what did Loki do? Ah! So what did Loki do? He kept climbing. He just kept climbing. His arms hurt. His fingers went numb. It got hard to breathe. But Loki kept climbing. One foothold at a time. All the way to the top. Nowhere to go but up. Okay, okay. Keep going. Come on. Can't stop now. <sighs> ah! Come on. <laughs> Uh, this way. Yeah, now the hell with that. No, thank you. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. Almost there. Hello. Uh, hi. So, what part of the enormous wall made you think, oh, visitors must be welcome? I was sent for, actually, by Odin. The Allfather sent for you. <laughs> Great. Then why are you out there, and not in here? Why don't we ask him together? Hmm. Ah! Oh! Are you finished? Now, what could Odin, all father, King of the Aesir, possibly want with the likes of you. Oh. It's between me and Odin. You don't even know, do you? <laughs> think you could pull me up, or... No, I don't think I will. I think maybe I'll drop you. No. No, 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 no. Yes, I'm Stop. going to drop you. Goodbye. Stop. Where? They come mad the Allfather's gonna be when, when he finds out you killed his guest. Loki of the Jotnar. <laughs> the Jotnar. Enemy of my people. I am not your enemy. I will be the judge of that. <laughs> this way, Loki of the Jotnar. Who the hell hey, is this kid? Is that Gallerhorn? Are you Heimdall? Obviously. Now feel free to drink in the splendor of Asgard. This is a rare sight for outsiders. Heimdall. Giants. Yes. Why not steal anything that is not nailed down? That is sure to impress your hosts. <laughs> Don't leave it lying around. <sighs> Just ask your questions already. How do you know I had questions? It is my job. 
Next question. What is your job? I protect the realm I love from trouble. And you think I'm trouble? You just met me. And I can already see you are eager to prove yourself. Way too eager. Probably due to an overshadowing father figure you can never live up to. Good guess. I would also guess that you are... disrespectful. Entitled and... impulsive. You don't know me at all. I help people. Oh! You are here to help people. Hmm. No. No. You are here to help yourself. To manipulate and lie to whoever you have to to get what you want. I know you're young. Your voice probably dropped while you were climbing the wall, but... <laughs> what a twisted little soul you have. <laughs> you are chaos in a spiffy archer suit. <laughs> I watch your mouth move, and I see cities burning. Nothing good is going to come from you being in Asgard. Yeah. That's probably accurate. That said, if you are here to aid the Allfather and have no treacherous intent, I guess that makes us allies. Ghoul Topper. Who loves me the most? Who loves me the most? Wow, that's almost as impressive as Balder taming a dragon. Balder had the luxury of not caring how badly he got burned. Uh -uh. I outthink them. Dominate them fair and square. Whoa, are these all Aesir gods? What? You think all Aesir are gods? But Skilder told me that oh. only. Well, if Skilder told you, clearly whoever that is must be the authority on Aesir gods, not. The Aesir god you are currently talking to. You literally know nothing of our culture, do you? I know lots of things. I know a giant built that wall. A giant built the wall that keeps out the giants. Primther, son of Thamur. I know the whole story. Really? I truly cannot wait for you to regale me with the revisionist tales of Asgard's architectural history. Is that Odin's palace? Palace? Do you think the All-Father needs to puff himself up like some mortal chieftain? I guess not. That is the Great Lodge, which the All-Father built with his own hands. I'm sorry if that is a letdown for you. Real power, you see, does not need to flaunt. It emerges when the time is right. Don't you agree? Hey! Whoa! Ah! Hey! Helmets! I brought you a practice demo. I thought we were going to own it! <laughs> you see, the thing is, you do have treacherous intent. So I am not letting you anywhere near the old. Do or I go! That's right! Show me all of your stupid little tricks. Ah, good boy. That is what he deserves. Oh, very nice. Who's that? It is a way that the Jotnard lost every war they ever fought. Bitch. Well, that was boring. Guess who's next? You sure you want to keep up on the waiting? Funny thing, I am sure about that. Yes, I am feeling very sure of that, in fact. Whoa! Whoa! How is he doing? Oh! Not even close! Oh no! Arrow! How fearsome! You're not gonna stop me from seeing Odin! You'll be seeing him from your grave. 
What? That doesn't even make sense. Is this all you've got? How have you survived this long? Oh, that one felt special. Hope that was not the last trick you have. Is that it? Is this all you have to show me, Jotun? <laughs> sure, completely ineffective, so keep doing it. Wow. I do have to say, Loki, I am profoundly unimpressed. You should probably stay down. Uh oh, somebody's in trouble. Great. <laughs> Knock it off. Like it or not, he's all father's guest. But I thought I smelled something. Take one more step, you're not gonna like how this ends. Really? And how do you intend to stop me? Look into my eyes. You tell me. <laughs> you are a sick man. Loki, you made it. I am so honored. I, I see you've met Heimdall. He reads minds for me. The boy is false, all father. This young man, who is my guest, is covered in mud. Care to explain? He means to betray you. <gasps> is that true, Loki? You a little trickster? Uh, I'm just messing around. Of course he means to betray me, huh? Heimdall, why else would he come? I've given him no reason to trust me. Not yet. But he's got some very big questions. And I have so many answers to give. What are you up to? Dismissed. Go. Gladly. <clears throat> and you, clean yourself up. But oh, my... Heimdall, will you just relax? Were you intending on killing me first thing? See? What, that's not good enough for you? Get out of here. <laughs> He's a lot, I know. Very perceptive, but sometimes he just forgets to think, you know? Hey, I got some places to be. How'd your father take the news that you decided to accept my invitation? I don't think we should talk about my father. Not well, huh? <laughs> Can't blame him. Between my ex-wife and my disgruntled former employee, he's not exactly getting an unbiased view. But you, you're curious, open-minded. That's important. Reist, Meest, carry on. Pretend I'm not here. If I'm being honest with you, Loki, you're lucky my offer still stands after you went and sprung tear. But I suppose spending time with him is punishment enough, isn't it? <laughs> At least Mimir never lost his sense of humor. But look, it, that's all behind us now. I like to keep looking forward. Hey, hey, hey! I want them trained, not decapitated. Just keep it below the neck, all right? Is that really what you do when I'm not here? All father. Queen Gana. The Ain Huyar are ready for your blessings. That's why I'm here, isn't it? Huh. Guess there's a new Valkyrie Queen. Great soldiers, these Ain Huyar, but they tend to come out of Valhalla a little foggy. I do what I can for them, help them remember who they were in life. That's important, don't you think? A sense of identity gives things meaning. Moon Thinafen, Hrothgar. Moon, Thinafen, Storm. 
Mul den Nafen. Jana. Okay, next up. Ah, the books. Good. Those are for him. I understand you're an avid reader. These are just a few things from my personal uh, collection. Thanks. Jurgen, those better not be mushrooms, I smell. Listen, I appreciate your offer, but I'm really not sure what you're expecting from me. Right now, you're just visiting, Loki. One step at a time. Steady there, Carl. But with all respect, you need to know. I came to study, not to serve. Another servant is the last thing I need. I need someone with drive, with curiosity. Someone will take initiative. That looks good. Is that braised? But why me? Is it because I'm half giant? Big deal. So is Thor. Erlen, <laughs> try to stay awake for me. Okay, but... Look, don't overthink it. I have a project I think you'll be interested in. A major learning opportunity for both of us. What about my family, my friends? I need to know nobody's gonna get hurt. Why would I hurt anybody? A truce is all I've been asking for from the start, if you recall. Look, you're here now. Stop worrying. It's all gonna be fine. Almost to your room. My room? Yep, just over here. Feel free to come and go. Take what you need, poke around as you please. You're not my prisoner. And more importantly, I am not your father. All father, there's a situation that needs your attention. Sif, you missed welcoming our new house guest. Say hello to Loki. This is him? Here. In our home. How nice. <laughs> My diplomat. Everything all right in New Midgard? The refugees are fine. The situation is with the dwarves. You know who is back. Yeah, it's always something. Put those books down. We got another stop to make. Uh, sure. Yeah. All right. I'm here. Where is he? He? Oh, he, uh, just over there. Oh, Father. Sir? <gasps> uh... Chief, it's been too long. What's the issue now? No issue at all if you're trying to build volatile death traps. I approve these designs personally, and not all that recently, I might add. Did you just wake up with the urge to be a pain in my ass? Yeah. Who's the cut? You're training puck pockets. You know what, Derlin? You reek of cheap mead, and that is by far your most endearing characteristic. Now listen up. It's me, your entire economy, speaking. Uh. I want you to know that I have confidence in you. Confidence you can deliver me these machines as promised, on time, on budget, and of course, safely. The dwarves have never let me down. <clears throat> Not about to start now. Right? Good. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna let you catch your breath. When you're ready to get to work and start getting those answers, meet me in my study down the hall. Oh, and help yourself to a change of clothes. Guess I could try this on. Has less mud on it anyway. Nice. Whoa, I can use this. Huh, nicely equipped. What needs work? Uh. 
Didn't mean to do that. Hmm. Nicely equipped. What needs work? Well, alright guys. That's where I'm gonna end this one. Good spot as I need to stop. And I don't wanna be going over two and a half hours, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe if you're enjoying the content I'm putting out and enjoying the series. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.